Welcome to Bob's Intriguing Facts. I'm your guide on this journey of discovery. My passion is unveiling the mysteries of our world and beyond, sharing captivating truths and thought-provoking theories. From exploring the depths of our oceans to unlocking the secrets of the universe, we leave no stone unturned. Today, we're diving into a topic that has fascinated scientists and thinkers for centuries. So buckle up and prepare to delve into the intriguing world of the Big Bang Theory. A myth or reality, let's get started. The universe holds many secrets. One of them is its own creation. This vast expanse of space and time, brimming with galaxies, stars and the unknown, has long captivated our curiosity. In our quest to understand, we've proposed theories, one of the most significant being the Big Bang, a theory that attempts to explain the inception of everything, a cosmic event of unimaginable scale and power. But how did this theory, the Big Bang, come into existence? And what does it really mean? In the early 20th century, a radical idea emerged that would forever change our understanding of the universe's origins. This was a time when the mysteries of the cosmos were being unraveled and a new theory was born, the Big Bang Theory. The seed of this revolutionary concept was planted in the mind of a Belgian physicist and Catholic priest, Georges Lemaitre. In the Roaring Twenties, Lemaitre proposed a hypothesis, a daring one that suggested the universe was expanding from a singular point, a concept he referred to as the primeval atom. Lemaitre's bold idea was that the universe was not eternal and static, as many had assumed, but had a specific beginning, a moment of creation. Yet, the scientific world is not one to easily accept radical ideas without concrete evidence. Enter Edwin Hubble, an American astronomer who was observing the galaxies through his telescope in the late 1920s. Hubble made a startling discovery. He noticed that galaxies appeared to be moving away from us, and the further they were, the faster they were receding. It was as if the universe was expanding, growing larger and larger with each passing moment. This was observational evidence that supported Lemaitre's theory, and it shook the scientific world to its core. Hubble's discovery was monumental. It suggested that if the universe was expanding, then if we were to rewind time, everything would converge to a single point, a moment of extreme density and infinite energy. This was the moment of the Big Bang, the birth of our universe, Yet, as with any groundbreaking theory, the Big Bang theory was met with scepticism. It challenged long-held beliefs and presented a radically new view of our universe's birth. The scientific community slowly started to accept this revolutionary idea, but it was not without its critics and controversies. As with any scientific theory, the Big Bang theory faced rigorous testing and scrutiny. Its merits didn't simply hang on the whims of theoretical postulations, but were put to the grindstone of empirical investigation. Let's delve a bit deeper into some of the major tests this theory has undergone. One of the most significant tests for the Big Bang Theory was the prediction of cosmic background radiation. The theory suggested that if a Big Bang did occur, it would have left behind a faint echo, a residual heat from the initial explosion. This echo would be detectable as weak microwave radiation permeating every corner of the universe. In the mid-20th century, this cosmic microwave background radiation was indeed discovered, providing a strong pillar of support for the Big Bang theory. Another key test centered around the abundance of light elements in the universe. The Big Bang theory postulated that in the first few minutes following the Big Bang, conditions would have been just right for the formation of light elements like hydrogen, helium and trace amounts of lithium and beryllium. Observations of the cosmos have shown that the proportions of these elements align remarkably well with the predictions of the Big Bang theory, offering another layer of validation. These tests, among others, have largely supported the Big Bang theory and solidified its position as the leading explanation for the universe's origin. However, let's not forget that science is a dynamic, ever-evolving field. Theories aren't static, unchanging entities, but rather they are living, breathing constructs, shaped and moulded by the hands of discovery and investigation. Yet in recent years, new observations have started to challenge the established view of the Big Bang Theory. As our technology advances and our gaze pierces ever further into the cosmic abyss, 
we are confronted with new mysteries and anomalies that don't quite fit into our current understanding of the cosmos. These challenges serve not as the death knell for the Big Bang Theory, but rather as the sparks that ignite the flame of further exploration and understanding. Science never rests, and neither does our quest to understand the universe's origins. As we delve deeper into the cosmic abyss, we find ourselves faced with observations that seemingly contradict the Big Bang Theory. One such conundrum is the Hubble Tension, a term that has been making waves in the astronomical community. This tension, or discrepancy, lies in the measurement of the universe's expansion rate. On one hand, we have measurements based on the cosmic microwave background, the afterglow of the Big Bang, suggesting a slower expansion. On the other hand, we have observations of distant supernovae and galaxies suggesting a much faster expansion. This disparity raises a tantalizing question. Could there be new physics at play that we haven't discovered yet? This crisis in cosmology further deepens when we consider the age of the oldest known star, Methuselah. Its age, estimated to be around 14.4 billion years, is older than the universe's age calculated by the Big Bang Theory, which is about 13.8 billion years. This apparent paradox leaves us scratching our heads. How could a star be older than the universe itself? Then there's the matter of the so-called axis of evil. This is a curious alignment of temperature fluctuations in the cosmic microwave background that, according to the Big Bang Theory, should be randomly distributed, yet they are not. They appear to be aligned along a mysterious axis, leading some to question whether this is mere coincidence or evidence of a deeper cosmic truth. These observations have led some scientists to question whether our understanding of the universe's birth is fundamentally flawed. But remember, science thrives on such challenges. They are not roadblocks, but rather stepping stones leading us towards a more comprehensive understanding of the cosmos. After all, the only way to uncover the universe's secrets is to keep looking up and keep questioning. Enter the James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's latest tool in the quest to understand our universe. This engineering marvel has been designed to peer deeper into the cosmos than any telescope before it. It's the scientific descendant of other famous space telescopes like Hubble, but it is equipped with technology far beyond what its predecessors could boast. The James Webb Space Telescope, or Webb for short, is not just an upgrade. It's a whole new level of cosmic exploration. It's equipped with a massive gold-coated mirror, over two and a half times larger than Hubble's, and instruments that can capture light from the most distant galaxies. This allows Webb to observe the universe in unparalleled detail and further back in time, giving us the potential to observe the universe's early moments. Here's where the Big Bang Theory comes into play. The Big Bang Theory posits that the universe began as a hot, dense point nearly 14 billion years ago. If this theory holds, then looking deeper into space means looking further back in time, closer to that initial explosion. Webb, with its advanced capabilities, has the potential to provide us with windows into those early moments. It's designed to detect faint infrared light, which is essential for observing distant ancient galaxies. These galaxies, formed shortly after the Big Bang, have had their light stretched into infrared wavelengths by the expanding universe. Moreover, Webb's infrared capabilities will allow it to see through cosmic dust clouds, revealing stars and galaxies that have previously been hidden from our view. This could provide us with valuable clues about the early universe and help us understand whether the Big Bang Theory can stand up to this new level of scrutiny. It's important to remember our understanding of the universe is constantly evolving. With each new discovery, our theories must adapt and grow. The James Webb Space Telescope is a powerful new tool in this ongoing quest for knowledge. With the James Webb Telescope, we stand on the brink of potentially groundbreaking discoveries about our universe. Its findings could confirm our current theories, challenge them, or lead us down entirely new paths of understanding. Only time will tell what secrets it will unveil. So, where does this leave us in our quest to understand the universe's origins? As we stand on the precipice of knowledge, the Big Bang Theory, while still holding considerable weight, 
is not without its challenges. The questions continue to pile up, each one more intriguing than the last. How did the universe expand so quickly after the Big Bang? What existed before the singularity? These are the questions that keep scientists awake at night, the mysteries that fuel our relentless pursuit of understanding. The impact of this ongoing research is monumental. It pushes the boundaries of what we know and what we can know. It shapes our view of the cosmos and our place within it. Every observation, every calculation, every theory brings us one step closer to understanding the origins of our universe. But what about the future of this research? As we continue to probe the depths of the cosmos, we can expect to encounter new questions, new mysteries and new challenges. We may need to refine our theories or perhaps even construct new ones. The path forward is not clear, but one thing is certain. Our journey of discovery is far from over. What does this mean for our understanding of the universe? Only time and the relentless pursuit of knowledge will tell. Ah, well folks, that's all for today's episode of Bob's Intriguing Facts. We've journeyed through the cosmos, delved into the mysteries of the universe, and even dared to question the widely accepted Big Bang Theory. I hope you found it as fascinating as I did. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. It really helps the channel and allows us to keep bringing you these intriguing facts and discoveries. And if you haven't done so already, do consider subscribing. We've got a lot more cosmic journeys and scientific explorations lined up for you. Remember, the universe is full of mysteries waiting to be discovered. As we continue to push the boundaries of our understanding, who knows what we'll uncover next. So keep exploring, keep questioning and stay curious. Until next time, stay curious my friends and keep looking up.